Hello, welcome to the video. In today's video, I'm going to be playing with a really strong and fast deck right now in the meta. It's this Mind Wall Breakers deck, and it's a really popular deck too. It's a deck like to test your skills, uh, to play a bit, to have fun too. And it's really good. And Remy Lee is like the best one with this deck. He has like the top one. He finished top one the last season. But he was using like Valkyrie and Skeletons. In this video, I'm going to use Knight and the Goblin and the Spear Goblins. I prefer this version here, but both are good. And before starting the video here, don't forget to like and subscribe. It's going to help a lot the channel. And okay, our first match, let's play some matches here on top ladder. Um, we're going to go versus, it seems like a log bait. And it's unfortunate this princess got like a lot of connections, but no problem. We have a pretty good matchup here, I think. We have the Tornado, we have the Log, the Magic Archie too. I think the Magic Archie here in this matchup is going to be my main like dealer damage and i can sink elixir i'm just gonna like, keep cycling wall breakers miners but a really good magic archer here is gonna kill the cannon and go to the counter attack you're okay, gonna put a miner here um okay log here he puts that mighty miner there that was a good really good mighty miner because i can't like tornado it to my tower Spirit Goblins here and should be a really good defense. Wall Breakers here just to pull the Mighty Miner and really nice. Activate that Sour here. I'm gonna activate that Sour, perfect. Uh, but that Goblin there, uh, that Goblin is gonna get a lot of damage. No problem, it's gonna Magic Archer here. It's gonna go to the attack and nice. It's gonna go the cannon and I'm already gonna Miner there to take the Magic Archer. I'm gonna log here, try to predict some goblins. Let's see if he puts it. Okay, at least he got the light spirit there. Um, perfect. It's gonna spear goblins here at night. This should fully counter it. Okay, nice, he got it. Now we have a really good counter attack coming back. I'm gonna magic archer here. It's gonna kill that princess. Go for the cannon too. And okay, he's gonna risk the log there. Gonna tornado here. Just to maybe keep the magic archer alive. Okay, this is a really good tornado. Let's kill the princess. It's gonna kill the mighty miner. I'm not even gonna use my log here. Yeah, I didn't even use the log and didn't take like any damage. Miner predict log. He didn't put the goblins. He's like playing really well. Yeah, he's gonna start rocking the tower. Um, okay. You have to keep pressuring here. I'm gonna knight here because he's gonna throw the princess. Okay, nice pressure with my miner i'm gonna split my wall breakers too and i need to get like a magic archer connection nice i got one connection there really good remember another one okay magic archer once again i have to keep the pressure up because if i don't he's gonna just cycle some rockets and okay, i'm just gonna lock the princess if he throws like a goblin bro i have tornado i have the spear goblins too and perfect this should be a really good tornado nice one shot two shots three shots four shots in the last one here perfect yeah this is a really tense matchup i was thought I was gonna lose here by the rocket cycle but okay ggs going to our next match here we're gonna go versus edu and this guy is like really popular using the balloon freeze deck with bowler the lumberjack i think you guys really know this deck it's really popular too and we have a pretty good matchup here but i uh, have to be careful because he plays really well with this deck and he can outplay the matchup. But if I play like just comfortable, uh, don't go really aggressive sometimes, I can win this. Get really good magic archers too is really important. And yeah, he's using the, the balloon deck, freeze, lumberjack, um, electro dragon. So here, I'm going to try to like activate the tower really soon in the match to help me versus the balloon. Here I'm just gonna miner. Maybe it's gonna attract that electro dragon. Nice, perfect. Gonna lock here. Maybe keep the magic archer alive. Okay, didn't keep it. Okay, no problem. Okay, here is it gonna go really aggressive. I'm just gonna knight here, bomb tower. Wait a little bit to tornado. Okay, can tornado right now. Oh my god, just missed the tornado. I uh, should have waited a little bit more to tornado it. That's not gonna activate that tower. Okay, but at least we didn't receive any damage. 
I should have let the balloon kill the bomb tower first, then tornado it to my tower. But okay, what happens. And let's go here with the spear goblin just to get some chip damage there. I'm not gonna magic arch here. This bowler is gonna be like really aggressive. I'm just gonna go magic arch here in the back. Just play a bit safe. He's gonna probably tornado it. So I just have to be careful. Yep, it's gonna tornado. Okay, here I'm gonna knight and wall breakers distract the infernal dragon. This should be a really good defense. Okay, he was first to use a barbro too. I'm gonna spear goblins and nice. And here in this matchup, I'm gonna like keep changing lanes. It's really important. Don't like focus in one because uh, he's gonna like just build a really good combo in a really big combo. We're not gonna defend it. Yeah, he's gonna come in here. So I'm gonna activate the tower right now. And then Front Dragon and the Electro Dragon is gonna defend it with troops. Okay, activating the tower. Wall Breakers to distract. I have another Magic Archer too. And I here to pull everything in perfect. This is a really good defense here. Didn't receive any damage on our tower too. Here I'm gonna go with the minor uh, spear goblins and while Brooks in the left lane. Um, okay, he was forced to use the freeze there, so really good. Lumberjack got two hits, uh, unfortunate, but <clears throat> he doesn't have like any big spell to keep damage in the tower. Here I'm gonna go all in with the wall breakers. I think this was a bit aggressive. I think not really, just because he wasted his tornado. So the magic archer here on my side, he can't kill it. Yeah, he doesn't have tornado to pull everything. Just gonna knight here. Gonna wait a little bit to put the bomb tower. Gonna put it right now. Perfect. Okay, spear goblins. This should like, resolve the problem. Yep. Gonna go here, miner. Split the wall breakers. Okay, didn't split it. But okay, at least we're gonna get like damage on both sides and not on just on the right one. Okay, things getting tornado here. Is he gonna tornado? This one shot, please. I got two shots. Uh, I don't have the bomb tower in cycle, but I'm just gonna tornado here in magic archer. Should resolve it. Magic archer here. And nice, the ball breaker got one shot there. So really nice and. Mm, unfortunately he passed us on damage but if you keep pressuring it I think it's gonna be really hard for him to defend it okay he's gonna probably go in right now i'm gonna really prepare my magic archer have my okay decides to go to the other lane you have to turn it everything back to cycle to bomb tower bomb tower here um okay you have the the right lane too i'm gonna cycle spirit goblins once again, Magic Archer, tornado everything back. And I already have another bomb tower. Perfect. Okay, I have to get some damage there. 20 seconds. I think the balloon is going to get to the tower. Unfortunately, the bomb is going to get it. But I think we could like, uh, maybe... Um, look at the look at the right lane. I'm going to Magic Archer, tornado. Look at the left lane. The wall breaker got a shot. Perfect. And this is a really intense match too. So nice one, let's go to the next one. Next match we're gonna go versus Legolas. Uh, he's a really good player. Let's see what he's using here. So we started with the uh, log, uh, bomb tower, tornado, and spear goblins. It's gonna spear goblins here. Okay, you should be using that minor mortar deck with knight and queen. It's a really popular deck right now in the meta too. Okay, you're just gonna minor wall breakers already, split the wall breakers. And maybe a magic archer here. No, not yet. It's gonna bomb a tower. And yeah, in this matchup, you have to get like 100% value with your magic archers. Never cycle it in the back because it's a free poison for you to open it. And play really well, like the minor wall breakers too. Bomb tower for the mortar. It's really good. And okay, put some minor there. It's a free activation for me. And this is looking really good because. We already have the tower activated. It's going to help a lot versus the miner. And, okay, he's probably going to come with mortar. But I'm just going to start with the knight here. Let's see what he's going to respond. Okay, knight too. And I, I don't know if he has, like, the poison or the fireball. I think it's poison because this deck is usually with the poison. I have to see still. Okay, look at this magic arch here. You're going to get the knight in the tower. 
okay one two shots three shots in this fireball so it's gonna be a bit more complicated than the poison one but it's 100 winnable and okay it's probably gonna go with the mortar here okay start with the queen it's gonna mine it here uh, okay when he comes with the mortar here i'm just gonna keep distracting the mortar with like spear goblins with wall breakers with the minor two okay he's gonna come in and distract here first with the spear goblins you know wall breakers right now too bomb tower here just to complete just to get the queen too okay this is a really good lock here getting the minor in the prince in the in the queen and nice really good defense spear goblins just to finish off okay zero damage we received so really nice and here i'm gonna minor just because we see these goblins wall breakers here to distract bomb tower for the knight and the mortar too look at this magic archer too getting some a really good damage on the tower nice so we're like equaling the damage on the right lane and the left lane okay knight here perfect i'm gonna mine here in this tile just to like if the mortar wants to aggro another car he's gonna go to the miner bomb tower here perfect okay fireballs i'm just gonna wall breakers really fast okay i thought the miner was gonna get to my tower um okay magic archer here just because he doesn't have fireball so this magic archer is gonna be really good He's gonna go to to the left lane, the lane that I'm attacking. I'm gonna lock here, try to protect some goblins. Didn't get it, but no problem. Tornado here looks tornado. It's gonna aggro the magic archer on the tower. And I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna protect it with my knight. Nice, got two more hits there. I'm gonna miner here. Keep up the pressure. Other wall breakers here for the mortar. And okay. Unfortunately, I think the mortar locked it. Yeah, locked the tower, but it's not like a big problem. Tornado the queen back. Just lock here, and this resolve the problem. Yeah, okay, nice. And yeah, the magic archer, yeah, decided the match for me here. The magic archer is so good here in this matchup. Look, I'm gonna do it again and get the goblins. I'm gonna lock here, and GG. The tornado here to finish the match, and a nice very really good a uh, victory here again and hopefully we finish the video here without any losses but let's see here our our rank so we're currently top 171 going to our last match here in the video we're gonna go versus the juicy one uh i don't know what he plays let's see right now start with the spear goblin it's really nice every time like get some good chip damage if it doesn't defend it and okay, he has skeletons. Skeletons could be anything. Okay, minion skeletons. It could be could be lava, could be nah. Okay, minor. I'm just gonna activate the tower here. Water breakers distracting the minions. And I think this is lava. Lava? Yeah, lava. Okay, it's the one of the worst matchups here for this deck is lava. I think Rimmy Lee, he like uh, plays really easy versus lava. I don't know how, but definitely is like the one of the worst matchups for 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 this deck. You're gonna distract through the infernal dragon with the spear goblins, pull it with the knight. This should be really good defense. Like cure and minor just to protect my magic archer. Okay, he miners my magic archer there. After just gonna sp wall breakers here in spear goblins. Hopefully, it doesn't have like a zap or snowball. Look at the wall breakers, they're connected to the tower. Okay, I'm just gonna tornado here everything back. Okay, this is this wasn't that bad. This could be like really worse. We got some good damage there. He received, he got some good damage here too. So, like, everything equal. And okay, in this matchup, I think it doesn't have fireball. I think he has arrows and zap. I don't know if he has zap, I don't remember. I think just zeros. So we could probably win this. Okay, I'm gonna start here with my magic archer. And yeah, I have to like protect my magic archer in this matchup. Mainly that. I'm gonna go in here to force him to defend and not go attacking. 
Okay, gonna bomb tower here on top of the lava. I'm gonna cycle to another magic archer. I'm gonna put it right now. Nice. Uh, fortunately, mm, the infernal dragon is really annoying too. I have to tornado everything back. Uh, but I think this tornado wasn't good. Yeah, it wasn't good. I have the spear goblins here. Mm, we can. Yeah, we're not gonna defend this. Um, okay. We have to go into attacking. We need to get the tower. Okay, we're gonna magic guard you here right now. I'm gonna tornado it back too. Okay, we got... Ah, man. <laughs> Lava in the front. I'm gonna spear goblins here. Wallbreaker just to maybe get some... Maybe some damage to get the tower. Okay, GG. Unfortunately, I didn't close 4-0 in this, in this video, but... That was the video. Don't forget to give a like, subscribe, and see you in the next one.